Lake Middle Schoolers <laughs> recently made history after being crowned co-champions of the 2019 Scripps National Spelling Bee. The Octo Champs are the first group to share the coveted title in the 92 years of the competition. Octo well, Champs. Octo Champs. You know what we're talking about. We're crazy. I, I'm not mad about this. Like, I these am. kids have worked are so you? hard. I, I, they won. There's got to be a winner. No. There's got to be a winner. Oh What's the God. point? They couldn't these, stump them. These kids have trained for years, studied, had tutors. I want a winner. They, and they look all happy, won the, though. They all got the $50,000 prize. Yeah. I mean, they all. But none of them got the honor, you know? But they, but they all, all have the should. honor. And look, like, and they all could be friends forever. I'm sure a lot of them don't have a lot of friends. I'm just stereotyping there. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just saying. But now also, they're all friends. All now they're all in the news. Yes. If one stupid little kid won this spelling bee, nobody would fucking care. Now we're like, look at the octo kid no. who can spell. Like the the freaking octo mom was in the news for a year. Yeah. Now, I want a true story like the kid a couple years ago who passed out in an earlier round <laughs> came to spell the word word white right in one. Sorry, right. I can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> I can't spell or talk. I thought you said he spelled, spelled the, the word, word white. white, and I was yeah. like, well, spelled... that's a horrible story. That's my speech impediment It's obviously W-Y-T-E. <laughs> <laughs> like, dumbass kid. My point is, he was such a genius that he came I mean, to you and still won. No, I, he was I just wanted, dehydrated, I want Brittany. a Victoria story like that. I want I, one. Okay, you know what? Watch no. Akilah and the Bee. Akilah and the Bee is a Great fantastic movie. movie. Great movie. I love Kiki Palmer. I remember when she goes, this. We only use words in dictionary. This. D I S. <laughs> That's in the dictionary. I remember that How one part. How do you run out of words? Right? They run out of words to stump them, apparently. Yeah. But can't they keep giving them words? We're not out of words. I don't get it. Yeah, but I guess like the level of word, there's only so many. And so what I've read, like in, that, that in past years, like in earlier rounds, they'll mm -hmm. do some of those like hard words and just like get kids out sooner, I guess. But as you get further towards the end, like if you've used those hard words, there's none left. But honestly, if you really wanted to wear these kids down to one winner, you could just be like, spell the word white, and they'd be like, I'm so tired, right. I'm so hungry, the last time I ate was like 48 hours yeah. ago, and they'd spell it wrong. Like, yeah. If you really wanted to, you know, one winner it, like they could have made it work, because after being in these spelling bees for so long, you literally lose like oh, yeah. concept of time and location. And you're like, who am I? What are words? Language doesn't really matter anymore. All I know about is like molecules. Right. <laughs> but what's interesting though, for, for they did have a tiebreaker thing for two years, but it was so that for 2017, 2018, you had to write a written test or something yeah. to break a tie, which is boring to watch. And like, they had to they define it, it. Right. Yeah. And they had to define the word and, define and know the what word. it means. I mean, that is putting the kids through so much. I'm not. I'm. I get the whole millennial Gen Z participation thing, you know? What? I hate that stuff. I mean, yeah. I get it. I was part of a soccer team, you get a trophy for playing, but these kids all worked very hard. They did. Yeah. Well, let's I, give it a go ourselves. I was going to say, oh. I have, uh, we're going to play a little game here. We have <laughs> we have some of the actual words that these kids had to, had to spell in the final round, and we're going to see if we are able to spell it. So now it's time for the Build Brunch Spelling Bee. Allie? Yes. Your word is bougainvillea. What? What is that? <laughs> Your word is bougainvillea. Okay, can I have a definition, please? Any of a genus of four o'clock family of ornamental tropical American woody vines and shrubs with brilliant purple or red floral bracts. It's a flower. Okay. Bougainvillea. B, B. O. U. G. A. N mm -hmm. <laughs> V I L L A Bougainvillea. Oh, so close. Uh. No! Oh, L -L -E -A. No! You were so close though. Oh, no I... trophy for you. Oh, I tried. <laughs> All right, Lucas. The word I'm gonna ask you to spell is pandalock. It's a noun, and it means a usually pear-shaped glass pendant used for ornamenting a lamp or chandelier. Can you use it in a sentence? Yeah. Um, damn. Don't look look at that panda lock. That panda lock is wild. Panda lock. Panda lock. Panda lock. Panda lock. Panda lock. You know what? They shouldn't have given me the bilingual <laughs> girl this word. I'm sorry. I'm he? like, you know the panda lock. <laughs> panda lock. You have 20 seconds. P Spell the fucking A N. Ah, it's already. Ah. Oh, D. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> P pan P A N P A E N Yeah. You know pan what matters oh, is what's on the okay. inside. P E N Pendle. Pan. I thought I said pan, whatever. Pan. I right. it, that's what it says here. P Lucas is like Pam Witzner. <laughs> yeah, Pam, 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 Pam Witzner. Yeah. Pam, where's Pam? You drink all your drink, that's Wait, why you're you ready? Huh? 
Your word is odilic. Odilic. Damn, sounds like a dick. <laughs> uh, sorry, can't work. Uh, odilic. <laughs> I should think she looked. She did though. O d y l l i c. Uh. What is it? Close. You just did the double L. It's just one. Oh. We're idiots. All right, I, I that's it. okay. Shannon. I can't wait. Your word is. I goulette. <laughs> I got this. Okay. Anyway, a, sh a shoulder cord worn by designated military aides. Hey, why don't you use it in a sentence, you little slut? Wow, his I goulette <laughs> is fierce. <laughs> okay, I got this. It's I goulette, A U G H E L L Y. Excuse me, bitch, I did not finish. <laughs> oh my god, fuck you. <laughs> is that Joe? Oh my god. <laughs> Joe is a fucking terrorist. <laughs> Fuck this, language mm. is made up, bitch. I'm a communications mm. major. How do you dare do this to me? Keanu Reeves and Tony, eat me mm. out. <laughs> Champion. Champion. Woo! See, this is why those kids deserve to win. Yeah, honestly. They like, need more fire in their belly like uh, you. Let them go. Honestly, I'm so happy for these Octo kids. Yeah, <laughs> the Octo kids. So proud of them.